That's right, Bob. We are back with week nine of the PPL. We have Drewby and the New York Marauders up against Jay Ricky and the Gigaton Hammers. And for those not keeping track, Drewby once again on a legendary run. I mean, how does anybody do it? How is anybody other than him capable of such a flawless legendary season. I've never seen anything like it. Going into week nine with a record like this, how does he do it? How does he do what I ask you, Jim? I tell you right now, being Bob the sports commentator and you being Jim the analyst, Jim, do you have any insight of what we got going on? <laughs> You're not Jim, but why are you talking? <laughs> I'm not ass your ass. <laughs> I don't care if I'm 0-8. I'm playing the game anyway. <laughs> about to be 0-9. Well, listen, man. You're about to be some goddamn bacon if you don't shut your goddamn mouth. Get out of my goddamn face. <laughs> shut up. Hey, guys. Me again. My camera's crooked, but I don't feel like fixing it. Kind of like my record. I just want to fix that zero in front of it. I don't want to do that. So, you know, it, it's, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just a... It's just, just boy things right now. Just boy things, you know. We're hanging out. 0-8, pushing 0-9. We got Jay Ricky in the building. And my camera is still crooked, but we're going to deal with it right now. What are we bringing to get through this last week of the PPL? We got Shaman coming in hot, coming in hot, coming in hot. Seed Flare, Dazzling Gleam, Leech Seed, Synthosis. Uh, what is, oh my god, my voice. What is going on? I'm cracking. Uh, uh, bro, I'm in shambles. I'm in shambles. The camera's in shambles, but... Shaman Seer, Physical Wall, nice, beefy, and zesty. Walled me out pretty well outside of that triple axe. But I'm bringing it. Otherwise, we're doing pretty well against that freaking Keldeo. And Iron Treads to some freaking extent. However, we know Rotom Heat's going to say, Yo, man, I got these Rotom Balls for your chin. I mean, like, yo, man, I got this Leech Seed that's hopefully not going to miss and land on you. And that's all I really got for you on that switching. So, if Rotom Heat comes in, we try to land that Seed and get the hell out while he bolts just for free. And then, well, there I go. It was all that. And then I gotta go into Mammoth Swan. Does he go for the fire attack and I take a thick fat damage? Or does he go for electric attack and I just absorb it? I don't know. We'll get there when the battle comes, you know? Oh, uh, but that's what we got going on with the Shaman. Just a nice beefy wall. Then maybe our potential lead over here. Ladius Arrogance up the wazoo. Choice specs. Drop a Joey. Call it a day, man. That's the goal. If you don't bring in Morgrim, I think that's what that freaking thing's name is. Whatever pre precedes, uh, 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 uh. I, I can't think of anybody's name right now. Those mods are freaking phenomenal. I should know it because he was on my freaking Orlando team. But anyway. Laddies comes in, drops a Draco. Does anybody like that? Not in the slightest. However, I think uh, his Terror, you can't see him below, but I think he has Terror Fairy on Hariyama and Rotom as well, of course, to make my life even more miserable. Actually, I think I have it right here. I don't have it on the layout, but I have it right here for me. Uh, yeah, no, it's Sinisha. Sinisha, Sinisha, I can't say that freaking Pokemon. Like, the one Pokemon I can't pronounce. And Hariyama could be Steel Fairy, and then Hariyama has an additional water on it. So, that's what we got going there. We drop a Joey, hope for the best. We have eyes, we do some big DPS. If we don't, what well, we cry, and we go 0-9. I don't know. Samrut is here to play a ball. You're gonna be scarfed. Razor Show, Ceaseless Edge, Sacred Sword, Flip Turn. Ceaseless Edge, not that great this week. The Pokemon, there's like so many Pokemon that are immune to it this week. I mean, we have you just in case. Obviously, like the Uxi and the Sinichar before it terrestrializes. Uh, we have Razor Shell for obvious reasons. Secret Sword for the flipping. Uh, uh, what's his name? Freaking Rolly McGee. And then Flip Turn, obviously, get the hell out of there. So, that's what we got going on. Terra Ice McGee. Coming in hot. We're going Discharge of Life Orb. We're just going for big DPS. We're just going damage. We're going damage. Switch it up. Discharge, Leaf Storm, Volt Switch, Terra Freaking Blast, being Terra Ice. Uh, Leaf Storm is indeed better for the uh, Iron Treads. Leaf Storm is good for the Keldeo, obviously. We also have Discharge as well. We can Volt Switch because you have no ground types whatsoever outside of Tread. If Tread is in against this, we can outspeed and hopefully kill it unless you have the freaking... Um, what do you call it? The booster energy. Granted, I could have got Mirror Herb here, but that's going to take a lot of, like, setup to try to get the Mirror Herb off. And if it's, like, if it's even brain the energy booster, then we're in a doozy there. So, I don't know. I figure we go for this. Give it a shot. Then we might leave with our nine cells. Freeze Dry, Moon Blast, Nasty Plot, Aurora Veil. I might just lead, click Aurora Veil. I might just lead, click Nasty Plot, and then just try to do some damage. That's, like, that's what we got going on here. I cannot spe I'd speed me out Skarada, but I could hopefully get a Veil off against it. And then, um... The uh, snow drops makes my defense higher on Electro because he's now Ice type. Same with the Mammoth Swine as well. And then speaking of Mammoth Swine, there he is. EQ, Rock Slide, Ice Shard, and in freaking Dur. Endure, Salak Berry coming in hot. Big DPS trying to do what we got to do. Um, 
And that's our boy Mammoth Swine, man. That's what we got going on this weekend versus J Ricky right now. Last battle of the season. Let's make it a good one. I'm talking really fast. I have no idea why. So I'm just going to literally do this battle. I'll see you guys there for the battle. Trainers, what is going on? Drewby here, coach of your New York Marauders. The final battle of the season. And some of you are like, thank God this dumbass is out of here. And to you, I say, I don't freaking blame y'all. Probably never get an invite to league play again. But hey, man, if people want me, I'll probably play again. You know, we can't we can't be sitting on this O and whatever record. Hopefully in this last, we can get a W. And hopefully my performance looks better than my hair because I'm a disaster right now going into week nine. But... It's going to be a doozy. I'm not confident on my team getting through Rotom Heat. I'm really not. I literally had like nothing for it in my whole entire team. So, the team I came up with in the team builder, you guys saw. If you didn't watch it again, I don't blame you. So, that is going to be that. Let's see what Ricky is bringing. And let's have a bodacious last battle. Like I said, if he's not bringing a fairy, I'm leading Ladius. I'm pressing Draco. And hopefully, hopefully, hopefully... You don't lead that Iron Treads. That is all I'm saying. Do not lead Iron Treads. I'm just going to drop a Draco. There is no Fairy Seer outside of Hariyama, which could be Fairy, Steel, or Water. And um, as long as you don't lead the Flipping Treads, we should be okay. Most likely lead we see on his side is like maybe a Scarf Rotom Heat, a Meow Skirata with U-Turn. Or Iron Treads. And against those, at least with Latias is good against the Rotom. Maybe fake at Hariyama instant terrestrialization. We'll see what we got going on there. Um, if you do lead Hariyama, what if it's like Flame Orb against and Shimon could get jacked up from that? I don't know. Maybe I shouldn't go Latias. You know what? You know what? Let's just go, let's just go Samurai. Let's just go Samurai. As, as a better matchup against all those. It can hurt Rotom Heat. Uh, he could hurt me out, Skarada, and he could uh, hurt Iron Tread. So, you know what? We're just going to lead Scarf McGee. Say, yo, man, I'm Scarf. Deal with it. That is the squad. Here we go, baby. Week 9 of the PPL Gigaton Mother Flippin' Hammers. New York, 0-8ers. Maybe 0-9ers or maybe 1-8ers. It's the final week of the PPL. And if history continues to repeat itself... I will win the final battle like I did last season. And we came up big and got the win against Joey. Despite a little luck finally going our way. However, that didn't matter right now. What does matter is this battle right here, right now. Meow Skorada! And the lovely Samurai. Right, right. Alright, boys. I got Sacred Sword. I'm ready to roll. Um, Samurai. Meowska Arrogance. If you're not Scarf, you are dead. Correct? Am I just raw dogging? I'm raw dogging Sacred Sword. I ain't never scared. Not once, not never. Slap those little Miascarada toesies. You're scarfed. I don't like that. And by scarfed, I mean Sash. And now we are. Whoo, whoo is what I say. Spikeroos. All right, he's ground type. All right. You know I'm scarfed. I bippity bopped. But honestly, getting you down to Sash is a beautiful, beautiful sight to see. And you better believe I'm clicking Sacred Sword again. Because if you even switch this thing out. I will gladly damage that Uxie. I'm going to take the opportunity to kill this thing. And I will do it right now. If you do Raw Dog uh, um, 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 Uxie. I'm just going to bring in like. Latius most likely. Um, But yeah I'm going to stick a sword again. Let's see if, if he saves this. Let's see if he does save it. Okay. Like I said I don't got to go crazy right now. I, 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 this is a, uh, not an obvious switch but it's pretty. Pretty, uh, pretty, uh, telling, you know. There's the Uxie. Not the end of the world. We're dabbling. We're hanging in there. A little DPS. Any Rocky Helmet. Any item knowledge. None at all. Okay. All right. I could go Latius. I also have Trick. I want to see what you got going on in Uxie Town over here. I think we're okay. We got a little DPS early on. We get Hazards up. Meow Skarada is Gonzo like the Muppet. We're feeling good about that. Right now, though, Uxie clicks Stealth Rock. U-turn. Or maybe or speed. I forgot. I don't think you get, I don't really think Uxie has good offensive coverage. It's more of a support mod. Let's see what you do. Let's see what you do. We got the battle of the golden boys right now. Rock a rose! And I say no no no! Because now I got nothing for the hazards. However, um honestly. Do I drop a Draco right now? Let's see what you would do. Let's see how much a choice Draco does, assuming you're like a physical wall. Because that did, like, nothing to you. Ooksie. Uh, 
Let me just see what my Samurai did. Sacred Sword did about 15%. Not even. I think you have lefties and I didn't realize you got recovery there. Vladis just, I don't know. Vladis just popped off three times, screwed about stuff. And it's like, yo, dumbass, choose a move. And to you, I say, uh, I'm dropping a Draco. So we're going for it, fam. We're going for it. Who's out? Who's coming in? Yo, let me get that. Let me get that Rotom. Please let me get that Rotom. Let me get that Rotom. Honey! Okay, he comes. It's fine. I'll drop a Joey. I'll drop a Joey. We're okay. We have eyes. Very good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. Chip away all day. I sense an ice spinner. I sense an ice spinner coming my way. I truly, truly do. So, Samurai, go do Samurai things. Eat the ice spinner. And, because you're not going to spin here. You don't have booster energy, so that's good news right there. Not bringing Mirror Herb on Electrode works out kind of well. I feel ice spinner's coming. My whole team is weak to it outside of Mammoth Swine. So, I'm going to just bring in my Samurai once again. Eat a rock. Eat a spike. It is what it is. And we're just going to rock out with our Samurai now, baby. Come on. Let's go. Let me see the ice spinner. Let me see the ice spinner. Let me see that ice spinner. F my life. That is no bueno. That is no bueno. Okay, good knockoff. Good knockoff. Good knockoff. Very good knockoff. I'm sitting here with my pants down. Um. Honestly, I don't know if you stay in here. I don't know if you stay in here. If I raise a shell or ceaseless edge, pretty sure Keldio comes in. I'm gonna flip turn. Yeah, he's going to bring in Keldy. I'm not going to give you a free Justified. You're out of your goddamn mind if I'm doing that. So, we're just going to flip turn here and get a little advantage. I don't know why I said it like that. I think I had a stroke with my record, so it's all good. Little flip turn action. No item revealed. I'm assuming your Scarf or Specs. Something. Something on this Keldio. Keldio is a nice offensive mon. Uh, the only ice attack Keldio gets, I believe, is Icy Wind. I could be completely wrong about that. Um... Could be completely wrong about that. Yeah, it's Icy Wings. And maybe you have Aerial Ace. Or uh, you have Air Slash. Alright, and you do have Aerial Ace. Um, I mean, I'm just going to go into you because I'm faster, right? Because I'm faster with Electrode, right? Get that momentum keeping up. I'm, I'm, I can't talk. I'm having a stroke. I don't know why. I can't talk today, dude. Alright, little things hurting me all here and there. Um, Don't think I'm terrestrial to Ice just yet. Don't think I'm doing it. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. All right, let's see here. Electrode, Keldeo. What are you? I mean, Leaf Storm slaughters you. I think we see Rotom come in here. And I will Volt Switch, because I'm going to Volt Switch here. Because I'm. It's a still weak, he's still weak to it. I'll find out if he's faster. If you bring in the Iron Treads, I'll stay in. I'm still at speed that. And if it's Rotom, I get the hell out of there. So I'll both switch here. I'll keep him at the I'm not going to terrestrialize though. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that. Kazuya Mishima! Even though it's Kazuha, but yeah. All right, that's fine. Rotom is here. We know what your item is. A little bolt switch action. A nice little chunk. Let's go, baby. Reveal my life orb. Now what? Now what? If you're not speed invested, my mouse going to outspeed and kill with Rock Slide. Same with Sam. Oh, no, Samurai's a speed slower, right? I think he's 86. Um, but if he has no speed investment, I feel like he yeah, does have no speed. Uh, Rotom. Rotom, Heat. Let's just say you're Scarfed. Volt Switch does about 22 to 27. It's like pretty much what I did there. Um, No idea what it is, though. I can just go into you. Get the bail up now or get a little plot going. Or I can just bring in Latius and just like, yo, man, let's see what you are. Just drop a Draco again. Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? Samurai's outsped. I'm assuming you you, uh, you asked me by a point. You literally asked me by a point, so. I'm assuming I'm outsped right now. So I think I just go Laddie. like I either go drop a Draco. Laddie is a great switch. I'll just drop a Draco. If I hit, if I hit a 1 HP Meow Skarada, it is what it is, but. I'll just drop a Draco right now. I'll take a little rock action, though. So. We'll jump a Draco, and we'll see what we got going on in freaking Rotom Heat Town. If we land this and clap his little oven cheeks, we're feeling phenomenal. We're feeling phenomenal, because I think you would drop to this. 
Yeah, you, you would drop to a Draco if you're not specially invested. You would drop to a Draco, 110 to 130, assuming you're just sp death, uh, sp sp attack speed. So, right now we're feeling okay. Right now we are feeling okay. If I'm him, I think Miascarta comes in here just as... Oh, he's Scarf, okay? He told me he's Scarf. All right. All right, he gave me the knowledge. And a free Draco. It's gonna hit the Miascarada, I'm assuming. I'm gonna hit the Miascarada. If I don't... If I catch anybody but Miascarada, I'm in shock. I'm in shock, and I'm very happy about it. If I catch me Ascarada, fine by me. That's one threat to Latias. That's like a big threat to Latias Gonzo. Gonzo, baby. Yeah, me Ascarada comes in. Uh, we have eyeballs, correct? We do not. So, of course, why would I have... Why would I have... Why would a pivotal moment in the game go my way? Why? Why would a pivotal moment in the game go my way? Well, now you get to enjoy, uh, enjoy another free hazard. So, that's cool. That's really cool. Um... Yeah. Why would a pivotal moment ever go my way? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Um. You know what I'm saying, fam? You know what I'm saying, fam? Kim and going to shame me. I think he's going to Mammoth Swine here. But he can make over back. It's actually insane how bad position I'm in now because of that. It's actually insane, dude. Um. Like, it's actually insane. Um, and he just might go knock off, you know. All right, I'm just gonna sack Samurai. I'm just gonna sack Samurai. I need a free switch into this thing, and I don't have it. So, hopefully you, uh, hopefully you go knock off. I'm hoping you go knock off here and not spikes. I'm hoping. Thank God. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. I can bring a Mammoth Swine now and just threaten. I mean, you maybe you're scared of Aqua Jet here. Maybe you're scared of Aqua Jet. I'm going to raise a shell. Yes, he's scared of the Aqua Jet. Yes, 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 yes. Free damage is great damage. Free damage is great damage right here. There we go. Chip that thing up, baby. Chip that thing up. Chip that thing up, baby. Very good, very good, very good. Now you're in range for a, a plethora of attacks. I get a free electrode switch in now once Samurai drops. So we're, we're happy about that. We know we're outsped. Secret sword right at me. I'm gone. That's fine by me. All right. All right. I'm not even going to bother with a Mammoth Swan just yet. I'm going to bring an electrode here. Oh, I can bring in nine tails. Threaten freeze dry. And a nasty plot for that matter. It's just Miascarada being alive literally is just absolutely insane. Oh man. Alright, um. It's just pressure. Let's just pressure. Let's just keep pressuring. Let's just keep pressuring. Let's just keep pressuring. Alright. Everything's gonna hit me. Uh, I will terrestrialize. Actually, no, I won't. No, I won't. No, I won't. Um. I'm going discharge. We might catch Uxie this time instead. We might catch Uxie instead. Or we just might kill Miascarada here, which would make me happy. Okay. Yep, we catch the Rotom with the Discharge. Fine by me. Fine by me. Fine by me. Okay. We know he's Scarfed. We know he's Scarfed. I'm going to try to get the Mammoth Swine read. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. This way we threaten the Miascarada switch in. And uh, we could also get like a little, uh, little, little Zest here. A little Zest here. We know he's Scarfed. And maybe, like, I miss Draco. Maybe you miss Overheat. Just maybe you miss Overheat. Let's see. Let's see. Mammoth Swine's in the building. Let's just see. Okay, we're even. We are officially even. We are officially even. However, you outspeed me. So... 
Overheat's really gonna hurt. Overheat is really gonna hurt. I'm rock sliding. Once we kill this Rotom, we could be somewhat okay. It does just take me out. Oh my god. So he's, uh, he's probably modest. I should have checked modest. That's on me. That's on me. That's on me. That's on me. However, you're like neg two. With you being at neg two. With you being at neg two. Like, I want to go nine tails. Yeah, now's the time to get your raw bail up. Now's the time for the bail. Now's actually the time for the bail. Once again, if Meow Skorade is not here, I just click Nasty Plot and potentially win the game. But guess what? I can't do that. Uh, let's just get the Aurora Veil going. And we're probably going to see Meow Skorada come in. And I'm going to get the Aurora Veil up and then hopefully you just take it out. Alright, there's Meow Skorada. Veil is up. We got six turns of that. I am just going to Moonblast. Break, break. Nice prep. Good prep. Good prep. Okay. Very good prep there. The Veil is gone. It's really weird how, like, Meow Skirata being alive at 1 HP just completely ruined my whole entire life in this game. Really, really weird. Just really, really weird. Granted, we got the overheat miss, but again, that didn't matter in the slightest because I still died to it. Didn't matter at all. So now I'm sitting here veilless and, uh... Just ain't looking hot, fam. Maybe I'll have a Volt Switch. I highly doubt it. I highly doubt it. But guess what? I have no Mon for this. And even if Samar was alive, he'd be outsped by the opposing Scarf. Even though I lost my Scarf. So, just really cool. It's just it's just par for the course, honestly. Not only am I just not playing Optimally this season, I just cannot get an ounce going my way. I know it's like I'm complaining, but after going 0-9 most likely this season, it's just the, the frustration has mounted up and it's hard. It's hard to try to it's hard to, to put on a show while the frustration just builds up. But again, Mama didn't raise no quitter, and I will be back if I'm invited to anything ever again. But let's get through this battle first. So there's the bolt switch. We're gone. And who comes in here? Who comes in here? The good news is I can just drop Joey's all day now. I can just drop Joey's all freaking day now. Until Hariyama goes Terra Steel, but or Fairy, but we're gonna we're gonna force that to happen. We're gonna force that to happen. I'm, I'm sure Hariyama is gonna go Fairy. Or say that shit doesn't matter. Either either one's gonna happen. Um, but let's see what he brings in here. Let's see who he brings in here, man. Alright, let's see who he brings in here. It's Uxie. Okay. Uxie is here. I mean, I could try to hang with Shaman. You're gonna die to the hazards. Um... Let me see Latius against Uxi again. He's at like 92%. Draco's not gonna kill. What do you do to my Shaman here? Should I be like scared? I'm just gonna go into Shaman and I'm gonna like try to like. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm gonna do, man. I have no idea. I could like try to catch the Rotom, but I don't think it's happening. I really don't think it's happening. I think you just click U-turn here. You click U-turn, you go into Rotom. I bring in Latias, you go Volt Switch, and then I just like lose the game. But nothing that speeds Latias. So you you go into Harry you go he goes to the Hariyama, he terrestrializes, I bring in Shaman again, see what he goes for. 
Um, he's gonna U-turn you. You're definitely gonna U-turn. I either Leech Seed. Or I just Seed Flare Rotom for damage. And go for like a crit on the Rotom. Or I decide to play it super safe and just get my HP back. But then Rotom just is chilling there again. Um, I'm gonna Seed Flare. You know what? I'm gonna Seed Flare. I'm faster. Okay. Does absolutely nothing. Spadef is harshly falling though. We did get that. And I, okay, he does use her. Alright. We ate that up. Good thing I didn't leech you. Alright. So. I'm going to try to call an over prediction here. I got to come back somehow. Because I don't think he could overheat. I don't think he could overheat because I have Lattes and he's just stuck there. But if he does overheat, I'm in phenomenal shape with Lattes. If you Volt Switch, then it's going to come down to like shenanigans again. And I don't know if I want to deal with that. And I need, I, I, I don't have the, I don't, these two are good against the Iron Treads. I really gotta hope you overheat. I really gotta hope you overheat or over predict. That's what I need right now. That's what I need. It's a modest Rotom that's scarfed. Uh. Oh my god. Rotom, Heath. Scarf. Modest. I'm gonna die to an overheat. Alright, show me overheat. Show me overheat. All the hazards and everything. Like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Show me the overheat. Show me the overheat. Please show me overheat. Please show me overheat. Show me overheat. Okay. Okay. I don't know who he's bringing in, but maybe I have a luring voice. No, I can't. I got. I got a Draco. I got a Draco. I got a Draco. I got a Draco. We're gonna catch. I don't know who we're gonna catch. Maybe Av Hariyama. Oopsie. All right. We'll just double Draco here. Should be enough. All right, he's gone. Very good. I'm at Nick two. I'm going to calc that just in case, depending on the, who he brings in here. Okay, that's got to be Hariyama, right? Yeah. So you're Terra you're Terra Fairy is what you're telling me. You are Terra Fairy, um, and uh, Shaman is just not looking good. All these hazards, dude, not looking good. Maybe in some... Universe, you go Terra Water. Maybe in some weird ass universe, you go Terra Water and not Terra Fairy or Steel. Just maybe in some weird ass universe, dude. All right, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I'm definitely faster. Show me Terra Water for some reason. Just show me Terra Water for some reason. Just show it to me. Steal. Okay. Alright. Fairy would have been better because at least uh, all their invoice would have hit him, but it's not going to now, so. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Okay, the game is just over then. Alright, very nice. Very nice. Nothing I can do about this. Um. I guess he has Bullet Punch, right? So if I get the neg two spit death and then Draco. I mean, it's probably hope if you don't have bullet punch now. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. He got it. The game is over. The game is over. But once again, like... If a Mia Squadra just dies, it's, it, it is insane how different this game is if Mia Squadra just dies. Let's try to paralyze you. If I don't die to hazards. Um, yeah, we need a para. And if we get the para, it's not going to matter. But, uh, you know. Discharge here. 
Let's see. Can I get static? Can I get the static? No. Okay. GG's. GG's, fam. GG's, GG's, GG's. It is what it is, fam. It is what it is. It is what it is, fam. It is what it is, fam. So, guys, I'm sorry for a horrible season. Uh, I, I, I don't know what to say. Um, okay, like, I, I mean, I said it before, I know I'm not playing great, but like, my lord, dude, my lord, man. So, that's that. Um, I'll be back eventually. So, I'll leave it at that. Guys, I know it's not the, always the best, but at least I, I hope I put at least a few smiles on when my videos go live. And I guess that's that. And I will see you guys whenever next time is. You can edit it, so okay. go for it. Fancy outro, yeah. Is that good? <laughs>